Now, here's Chief Meteorologist Tony Petrarca with your live Pinpoint Doppler 12 Futurecast. Well, snow in early April, not that uh, unusual. And uh, coming up during our 6 o'clock newscast, we'll talk more about that aspect of uh, New England weather. Boy, what a change this afternoon as far as, you know, shutting off the snow and melting a lot of it. Temperatures today with partial brightening through the cloud cover, able to get readings up into the mid-40s, helping to melt things a bit. We are cool in Smithfield right now. Clouds and a little bit of sunshine sneaking through right now. Temperature coming in at uh, 41. You know, some of our webcams, you can see breaks in the overcast in downtown Providence, uh, out in Nantucket with improved visibility. In fact, take a look at Narragansett, mostly cloudy, some partial sun. Now, just two, three hours ago, uh, the lawn was completely covered in several inches of snow. Look how quickly the snow kind of disappearing and some of that uh, melting this afternoon. And you see some breaks in the overcast right now. Temperatures range in the upper 30s to low 40s, including 41 Providence, 39 New Bedford. Now, temps late tonight towards daybreak will fall below freezing. Now, here's the situation for tonight. Overall, no major problems this evening. Again, the one thing that we'll watch for later tonight, some fog late at night. So any ground fog that forms would just add... Uh, moisture to the pavement and with temperatures getting near freezing by daybreak there may be some patchy black ice so that's something that we'll watch closely in the meantime tomorrow uh, overall at least during the morning nothing much in the way of widespread precipitation but you know do allow a little extra travel time once we get towards late afternoon and tomorrow evening around this time with some steady rains and wet roads and certainly a slower commute but it would not be snow, uh, but rather rain with temperatures in the mid 40s. You see the clouds thinning out a little bit, some partial sunshine out there right now. You can see the clearing through upstate New York and some of this drier air continues to work in this evening. Meanwhile, this is our next system. And you can see moisture across the nation's midsection. This is arriving for tomorrow afternoon and especially this time tomorrow evening with widespread uh, chilly rain and not snow. Getting real close, take a look at Futurecast. And you can see for this evening and overnight, we are generally clear to partly cloudy. Now, this is 2 o'clock in the morning. You see temperatures near the freezing mark. Now, watch the patchy fog form. And all that does is it adds moisture to the pavement. So, again, there may be some patchy black ice just before sunrise. Clouds on the increase. This is 1 o'clock. We're mainly cloudy, a couple of sprinkles. And then here comes the widespread rain. This is 4 o'clock in the afternoon. The evening commute is very wet, 6, 7 o'clock tomorrow evening. And this continues through early tomorrow night with a widespread rain. Tomorrow morning, a dry start. Temperatures between 30 and 35. Any hazy sun wouldn't last very long. The clouds take over, and here comes the steady rain, especially mid to late afternoon. It's chilly. It's raw. The temperatures are only in the 40s. The good news with Wednesday, it warms up to the low 60s, but we do have rain showers and some fog. We're cool, dry on Thursday. The Red Sox home open or sunshine, but jacket weather. More precipitation on Friday with some cool rain showers. Uh, weekend looking okay. We're going to be watching an offshore storm a Sunday night. Uh, in Monday, but as of now, the weekend looking okay, but temperatures running uh, a little below average. Really, only one warm day, and it comes with rain, and that is on Wednesday. Bottom line, it's a pretty cool week ahead. So the snow is still all over my driveway and lawn when I left my house around noon. Gone. It gone. better be gone no, when gone. I get home. It's gone. <laughs> all right, Tony, thanks. All right.